Whew, we have had a busy weekend. <laughs> Jen, Jen's looking for the frog right now. She's wondering where it is. Every time we pass by there, we look for the frog. I happen to grab a picture of it. Oh, she's waving. She says, come on over. Must be able to see the frog. Well, there's Zeus. I was wondering where he was. All right, let's go see. We find the frog. It's big. It's big and They're getting really big. Yeah. And the frog. Where is he? Well, she just took off, and I have no idea what the. What? Is he here? She won't even. She can't hear me. Things too noisy. Well, she must have seen it. I got a picture of it. So that was pretty cool when I caught that. It's feeding time. Well, it's not really feeding, feeding time. We've always got food out for them. But they do tend to get a little more excited when things are nice and full. So. Anyways. This video isn't about that. Ah, uh, busy weekend. We got so much done. Uh, but the bigger news is that Shar's gone back home. She finished off with a bang. I'll show you some video shortly here. On, uh, I put it up on the 360 channel, but not too many people subscribed there. So I thought I would just edit it up to be normal footage. And you guys can see how she tackled our obstacle course, which she also managed to do a teeter-totter fit. We've got this here now. We've got a log underneath. You see there? And uh, she managed to tackle the teeter-totter, which was very cool. Very, very impressed with her. So she's back home. Her owner's super happy. She's going to be starting a brand new adventure. Or maybe the same adventure that's kind of been going on. It's really good. She's really happy. I'm happy about that. Horse is good. Baby's good. She's moved up to here. We got Luke, Roni, and Piggy and Lena at the back. And we finally have time to get on with all kinds of things. So I'm excited to show you guys that this week. Uh, we've got some more stuff going on in the forest. A couple other builds going on. <sighs> the trailer's clean again. Yeah. Oh, you guys should have seen the sunset tonight. I can't, you can't see it from here, but uh, I did get some drone footage. Let's put that up. Anyhow, so that's it for today. Hope you guys enjoy the, uh, the sort of ending on a bang, sure. Work in the obstacle course. And I'll see you guys again real soon. Okay, we're out and about on a nice, beautiful morning with Char. Got a few uh, scary things for her to tackle. So let's see how this goes. You guys get to watch this in 360. I'm just going to go about my uh, work with her. And uh, I may narrate or put some text up, but I don't have my external audio or microphone on me this time so uh, <laughs> i may she doesn't like that thing uh i may come back and chit chat with you guys but for the most part let's see what you think okay Shar, you're up let's walk around a little bit first
One more time. Oh, she's come a long ways. That's a big deal. near me. Go that way. The bridge. Let's go. Come on, Sean. Good girl. That's pretty good. A little quicker than I expected her to get through this stuff. Let's see if we can drive her on. Come on.
thank you. Okay, let's go back over to this thing over here. Good. It's stuck a little. We'll go across the bridge again. Oh, you cheated. You cheated. Come on. Get up there. Hey. You can't be like this. Come on, back up. Pretty good. Okay, last one. Now, Come on, sir. Okay, there you go. Come on. It's not that hard. Girl.
good girl. Okay, one more go round. No problem. Well, I'd call that pretty successful. I'm actually quite happy with that. So I'm gonna let her go for now and uh, let her go roll and stuff like that. Call that a good, successful training session. And there you go. And that's just a few less things for her to for her to be afraid of anymore. Okay, we're going back. Jen says they're right here. So let's go take a look. Again, this is going to be a final excerpt of this video. I think it's this. Wait. Now they're moving because you're doing that. You're quiet. Well, I've been here and. See, now they all just went away. Wait, who's they? The fishies. Oh, you're commenting on the fish. I thought you were talking about the frogs. No, the fish. Oh. See the fish. Zeus, right here. where's the fish? They're right here. Oh, Jim says they're over here. They were all there. There's probably 25 of them or so. Can 20. you see them still? Yeah. No, not really. Yeah, there, I can see them. Come. I can see them. It's going back up. It was better before. There's some going that way. Fish, not frogs. You're there. Coming right up here. Surface. Yeah. They're big. Yeah. Yeah, they're getting bigger. Zeus is getting excited. Zeus. No you? fishing. So let's get out. Wow, All such right. A big yeah. Well, that's pretty cool. I thought you saw frogs. No, I did. Both the frogs were out. One frog was over there, and one was over there. Over there, she says. He was sitting on his rock. He was sitting on his rock. Now even the fishes are there. Aww. They probably saw Zeus. <laughs> <laughs> it's a dog. Ah! Quick, swim away. Yeah, there's a couple over this way. It was such a big group and they were so bright, they were right at the top. Yeah, they're out there. I can see them swimming. Yay! Yeah, it's cool. Um, I have an idea. Okay, Jenny's on a mission. So, turns out that Lena and Peggy really enjoy each other's company. Even when they have the opportunity to be in different paddocks, they, uh, because we open up these two gates, as you've seen in other videos. This is some of the, one of the concepts we really promote around here, is making sure that everybody kind of has a buddy. Does it matter which one? This one or this one? Uh, maybe the middle one's probably pretty good. I know, but you put three. So, I'm going to take out the screws, take off the boards. Now these two... <laughs> Is supposed to make that sound? No, it's just the... There you go. Sorry, Jim. 
Jenny, get it lined up a little bit better. It's pretty good. Poor horses. Oops. It's hard work. Oops. You'll get it. No. Anyway, so these two can then chill out together. This is good for them. Do a little bit of construction around them. <laughs> but they really like each other. Oh. Oh, <laughs> Piggy says, I can almost jump over. Anyhow, so um, whenever we put horses together, even if they've only got this little fence on, we will try. Nope. Right. They will try to um, groom, look, co groom. And uh, it's really, really good for horses to be together. A horse that's alone is definitely a sad horse. Um, like a lone one. So, since these two get along so great, I we might as well just put them all in, put them both in one big paddock. But they'll each have a feeding station. So feeding station number one and number two. I think that's when you strip, sweetie, going in. Oh, it's my fault. Got it. Yeah. You can't even see it. It's so buried. Oh, I see. Okay, I'll get on that. All right, screws removed, fence boards removed. This has now become one big, huge paddock. And we had planned this in the past to be like this, or at least have a gate in there, removable. I mean, they're always removable. They're just screws, not nails. I it if it was nails, would be removable, but easily removable. It's okay. Okay, poor, poor Lena. Hiding. Hiding behind the tree. Oh, here comes Peggy. Peggy says, no problem. Don't touch my food. Oh, she's good. Oh, Nina is a shy one a little. Okay, well, you guys are witnessing a little bit of history here. A new change to the place. I've been kind of been thinking about it for a while. Just needed horses that would be good enough for the job. And these two are. <laughs> now she's off. Yeah, let's go to Peggy's. <laughs> she's just in the middle. You know when there's that border between two countries or whatever it is? Yeah. <laughs> What's going on here? All right, well, that's it. So that's great. It's really good for these two. <laughs> Yay.